are programming skills essential for a career in supply chain? Hmm. Hi there, this is Abhilai Shiridas signing in for yet another episode from the SEM Skillers channel where we talk about supply chain and supply chain jobs. Now, since you guys all love our content so much, we we'll request you to please make YouTube happy by liking, sharing and subscribing to our channel. You would get new video notifications as and when we post them. Now, a lot of our viewers have asked us right after our last video, how important are programming or coding skills in supply chain. The questions ranged from are they important, are they essential, to the end extreme of can we even get roles in supply chain without having programming or coding skills. Okay, so without wasting time, let's jump right in to this very hot topic. In our last video, we spoke about the five core constituents of the supply chain, which are plan, source, make, deliver, and return. In addition to that, we also spoke about one underlying uh, support system called enable. Now, while software skills or programming skills rather are always going to be helpful, it's always an add on for any of the, the five core elements of the supply chain. The good news is that none of those core elements require programming or coding skills as an essential component to get a job or to grow in that area. There would be a lot of uh, requirement for, you know, uh, for physical supply chain related activities, for uh, knowing the flow of the process and so on and so forth, but programming not as much. Now, while I say that, it is also important to understand that Despite programming not being an important part of it, for all the key uh, core elements of supply chain, some level of software skills, at least the user level software skills are important. In fact, as you grow within the supply chain, the requirement to get better and better at handling different types of softwares, you know, ERP systems, workflows, uh, you know, uh, some level of RPAs, etc start increasing but that all comes at you know at a later stage it's not really required at the initial stage when you're trying to enter into supply chain of jobs right so that's the first thing to understand now you'd be wondering if there is no relevance if there is no importance of programming skills in supply chain then why would someone have this kind of a question well that's where we should talk a little bit more about enable which is the sixth constituent of the supply chain. This is where programming skills play maybe the most important role in supply chain. Now, what does enable constitute? It constitutes managing the underlying IT architecture that supports such a complex operation that covers all these five core elements. To handle that would require a very high degree of programming and coding skill. The reason why the question is so relevant in today's environment is because the highest paid and the most lucrative jobs in supply chain across board lie in this area in today's world. So in short, is programming or coding skill an absolute essential to get a supply chain job? The answer is no, because in the first five core elements, it's not a requirement at all. However, if you are really looking at the, the best roles or the best paid jobs that help in the supply chain, then you are actually asking me about enable. And here, absolutely, programming skills are a huge, huge benefit. And in fact, in certain areas, it is absolutely a non-negotiable component. Hope that answers this question for all of us. Now that we have understood the level of importance of programming or coding skills within the supply chain umbrella, I'd really like to hear more uh, about what you think about different types of roles. Uh, would like to hear your comments about today's video and also any similar questions like this that would help us to come back with a, a researched answer 
to these questions. Looking forward to our next video. Looking forward to a lot of interaction. Please keep the comments coming in. Thank you. And for the time being, sign out. Being ready for the next one.